Plenty of people say he is the best American comedian the country has ever produced. He changed the entire context of stand-up comedy. Unique is the word. There's, there was just no one like him. Everybody, please get your hands together for Brad Bellinger. <laughs> <laughs> Coming in here like he owns the place. <laughs> Okay, easy. I did my research for that joke. I googled, do Chinese people eat cats? All I had to type in was, do Chinese? The first suggestion was, eat cats. <laughs> he was interested in social hypocrisy. I so bad want to tell an NYPD officer, kiss my black ass. And the cops came up and took him off the stage. I thought there was going to be a riot. You spend your life being funny, but the other side of funny is tragedy. That's one of the unfortunate parts of this story, is that he was on drugs, or drinking. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm drunk. I call the movie a movie. <laughs> is this guy drunk? Yeah, I'm drunk. Do you want to come up and fight? I'm ready for you. He was getting more and more paranoid and difficult to deal with. <laughs> I am, I'm nervous. I am very nervous. This is hard. There's a basic neediness in most comics. When you're on stage and you're doing really well and you're killing, and they're giving back to you. I'm sorry, do I feel like you love me? I love you! You guys need to live a little. I'm just saying, like, I smoke weed, massages. You guys just come here and listen to me tell you about it.